what's going on? Hey, we've got an unbelievable little episode for you right now where I take this boat and I take Hillary, which is in there right now, and we go bass fishing. And this is one of those moments where I'm just going to remember for the rest of my life, she catches her PB. And it was an unbelievable moment. So guys, this is a show that aired on Discovery Channel. Ah, I cannot wait for you to see it. I cannot wait for you to check this out. But before we get into that, real quick, let's talk SMC merch. SMC sweatshirt, SMC hats, all available, along with t-shirts and everything, in the link in the description. So go check it out. And in the meantime, guys, enjoy this episode. It is, it's just one of those moments. Check it out. All right, Hillary, let's go in here and grab a few things for our trip. Now, just to clarify, guys, here's what we're doing, Hillary. Just so you know, we are gonna go to the Harris Chain. The yep. Harris Chain, I have to do a little pre-fishing for the upcoming tournament, and I figure I'd bring you along. We could run out here in Hook and Chevy, but it's a little windy. Mm -hmm. I, I but they should be spawning, because it's a full moon. So if they're <laughs> spawning, and you can catch like a eight or nine pound bass, that would be awesome. Yeah. That would be really awesome. So let's run in here, grab a few baits, grab a few drinks, see what's up. Well, I'll tell you what, I'm so excited about spending the day with my Hillary because she loves to fish, I love to fish, and the fishing's, I think, gonna be pretty good today. You excited? Yes, I'm so excited. It's gonna be so much fun. I think she's more excited about missing school, too. Yeah. All right. Might need a few of these. You know, today's adventure is gonna be all about trying to find some fish on beds, maybe throwing some little crankbaits, some square bills out in the lake. Hillary, we could find a big gigantic bass for you yes. to catch today. That's kind of what I'm thinking. So, you excited? I'm, I'm super excited. I am too. You know, we've got a couple hours left in the day today. Let's go out and evaluate, hope we find a few, find an hour or two that's got some fish in it. And we're gonna spend all day tomorrow mm -hmm. fishing. So, yeah. all I can say is, let's go fishing. I'm gonna launch it. it. All right, Hillary, that's, um, let's start trolling running around now. Again, here's what we're gonna do. It's not about fishing, fishing. So we're yeah. not gonna even pick up a rod. We're just gonna look for beds and try to see what, I'm practicing, trying to see what canals have fish spawning, what canals don't. The canals that are, I know that are good for spawning, they don't have any fish spawning them. I know they're gonna be good in a few weeks when the tournament's here. The ones that are full-blown spawn right now might be a better for a post-spawn bite, like fry garters and things like that. Mm -hmm. On a, we find a canal that's got hundreds and hundreds of beds in it. In two or three weeks, those fish are gonna be done spawning. Those little baby bass, the little fry, will be around and take top water, come in canals with a lot of fry and kill them on top water, good but the canals that should have spawners that don't now, again, we'll have them in a couple weeks. So that's what we're doing. We're trying to learn. And at the same time, if we can find you a big old donkey, <laughs> you're gonna catch it. <laughs> I tell you what, I'm so excited about spending the day with my Hillary on the water trying to catch one of those, or her trying to catch one of those giant bass. Are you excited? I'm super excited. <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> There's some big ones out there. They like to spawn up underneath. They like sunlight. So, like, ooh, there's a, there's a, there's a, look, there's one right there. Two and a half. Oh. See him right there? Look, dad, right yeah, there. I see him. It's like a two and a half. Can I catch it? But I'd love for you to catch that one. It's not a real big one, but we gotta start yeah. somewhere. Yeah, I know. So I've got an idea. Even though we have some stuff, I just, well, right before we left, I got my shipment of mystery tackle box. And let's see what's in here. Oh, look at here. These right here are smart baits. See, all you want is something that's kind of bright, something you can see good, and that right there, even though it's crazy looking, will be great for sight fishing. Oh yeah, look, it's got little legs. Looks like a little, like a little salamander, catfish looking thing. Oh, that's gonna be pretty good. That was kind of a last minute grab, but uh, this is a monthly tackle subscription, Mystery Tackle Box, and it's full of a lot of cool things. I bet we can catch one on that right there. Look for movement. Some of the beds will be real bright and obvious, and some won't. 
All right, well, we're gonna have to get some snacks tomorrow because you know we're gonna be out here all day, so. <laughs> we'll get snacks. Look at that bass. There's about a three pounder. Take care of that, Dad. Well, then let's get it. Yeah, we, 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 that's a great idea. Okay. I'll spin around. All right. That's a snack bass. Yep. And what we're doing is we're just being real still, got the power poles down. You know, we're making long pitches in there. We're trying to you know, like pitch past the bed, pull the, pull the bait into the bed, trying to visibly see how that fish reacts every time I get it in the bed. You know, is it starting to show interest? Is it swimming off? Those, those are the things you have to figure out when you're sight fishing. This one's showing some interest. Now it's just a matter of getting the right position, getting the bait in there. I, th I think this fish is going to bite. I do too. So Hillary's standing up on the cooler. She can kind of see the fish moving around, and 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 she, you know she's having a little bit of a hard time getting that bait in the exact spot. So I'm kind of pitching it in there for, her, but handing it to her, and then she's working the bait. And and Hillary, you're doing great. I mean that fish is getting really close to biting. Just I'm telling you, you're going to feel it thump it here any second. Dad, what? Here. Set the hook. Set the hook. Set the hook. Set the hook. That's the male. That's the male. That's all right though. That's all right. Get him in the boat. Swing him right in here, darling. There you go. There you go. There you go. Now, that female will probably bite now. It's a nice fish, though. All right, good job. A little. That was a little teamwork on that one. Yeah. But you had him on twice before. He was getting a little stingy. <laughs> so we had, to, we had to put a little teamwork on it. But that's one down. One down, some more to go. All right, so, so far, what did we learn today? We learned that, here you go. We learned that there are fish spawning in this canal. And there's yes, some big did. ones in here. Mm -hmm. So why don't you let him go? Bye bye now. The goal has now changed. Forget practice and for the tournament. The goal now is to get Hillary a gigantic bass. That yep. is the goal. Yep. That is the challenge. That is the Scott Martin challenge. That's what this show is going to be all about. Hillary, are you ready? I'm ready. You did good today. You caught one. Mm -hmm. We just we we got bamboozled by the other big one. Yep. That's all right. Mm -hmm. Let's go get some dinner. After this commercial break. The Scott Martin challenge is brought to you by. Trocar, the world's sharpest fish hook. Ranger Boats, still building legends one at a time. And by Evinrude E-Tech G2, the outboards that are changing everything. This segment of the Scott Martin Challenge is brought to you by Chevy Silverado, the most dependable, longest lasting full-size pickups on the road. Okuma Fishing Tackle, there's no stopping Okuma. And by Garmin Panoptics All-Seeing Sonar. Join the pros who switch to Garmin. This lake is one of about eight or nine lakes in this series. And we're gonna launch here and go through all these little canals and through the swamp. It's really pretty. It is really, really pretty. You ready? I'm, I'm ready. excited about spending the day with you today. I'm excited too. Fish. We got yeah. the snacks, right? Oh yes, we have the okay. snacks, right? Okay, all right. That's all you're worried about, isn't it? <laughs> no. Dad, this is like the most beautiful place I've seen. I mean, coming through here is like amazing. It's like the sun coming through, it's it's beautiful. Big tall cypress trees, yeah. it's like being in the jungle. All the, yeah. all the mossy oak hanging down. Well, just on the other side, there's some big old bass. Got it. Good, good. <sighs> That's good, that was good. Look, like he took your legs off. <laughs> yeah, he did. <laughs> took the legs off. Set the hook. Got him, Hillary, keep going. Oh. Dang it! It was a big one. I, I think he's for sure five pounds. Yeah. You, you set the hook right, you fought him right. I don't, just hit him hard. Hit him hard. Like, you won't break the rod, but try to break the rod, Hillary. Okay. That's the second time you did wonderful. But this fish, I'm mad. I'm mad at the fish because you fought him, he got out of the pads, I was underwater shaking his head, and he got off again. We're not leaving until we catch this fish. <laughs> Hillary, get him, get him. Stay tight on him. Dad, that is not a three pounder. That's gotta be more than He's just. He's big. Here, come on down off the cooler. He's a nice one. Teamwork, baby. Got him, Hillary. Ooh. That's a duck, we shared that one. We yeah. shared it. You had this fish hooked three times. It took long enough, but I'll tell you what, we got them. And the trick to that, Hillary, was patience. We had the power poles down. You had that fish hooked three times, and for some reason, it just got off all three times. And uh, we did a little teamwork on that. Yeah. So we had to do it, but there's got to be more in here. That is awesome. Her first fish on this trip, a five pounder, guys. How about that? Hillary, you did awesome, darling. Mm -hmm. Just let him go. You want to let him go? Yeah.
I knew that was bigger than that. I know. Three. I was like, what? <laughs> Sight fishing is so much fun, but at the same time, it's stressful. Would you not agree? That was stressful. She was like freaking out. Like, I could, I'm not doing it again. I'm not, three times I've missed this fish. We'll find another one. We'll find another one. It's warming up. And I think as the temperature rises today, they'll get more active. They'll get more active for sure. So that was, uh, that was cool. This segment of the Scott Martin Challenge is brought to you by StarTron. StarTron enzyme fuel treatment cures and prevents ethanol fuel problems. P-Line, delivering the leading edge of quality, high performance fishing line. And by PowerPole, swift, silent, secure. Well, it's finally here. My brand new Ranger 520L matched up with an ever new 250 HO G2. I'll tell you what, this thing is awesome. It's got some really new styling on it, some new features. Let's jump up in and check it out. Here's what I love about this console. The thing looks like a Corvette. I mean, this thing is awesome. The styling is impeccable. Tons of room right here. I've got plenty of room down here for my legs. You know, it's got a nice tilt steering wheel, all the control panels. And here's another thing about this console. You can put, even though I have two Garmin's here side by side, you can put a, up to a 16 inch graph in this new console. And the best part is it's got all these switches, all waterproof and all in one spot. Now, I like this feature right here, these big oversized seats that Ranger has, super comfortable and totally adjustable. The other thing is they have a nice center compartment right here for all your maps, your cell phones, whatnot. They even have a USB plug on here, which is something that I love. And my favorite compartment on the boat, the Ranger Live Well. These things are awesome. They keep the fish alive. They're the perfect size for those big old bass. Now let's run it to the front of the boat. Let me show you a few things. This boat has storage for days. I'm a tournament fisherman and I take a lot of stuff on the road with me. I've got plenty of room for all my rods, organized rod locker. I have plenty of room for all my hard boxes, line, scales, everything that I need, all in these waterproof, watertight, vented compartments. These things are the bomb. Tons of room on the front of this boat. I can put plenty of rods in the right or left of me and still have lots of room to get around. It has plenty of room as well for graphs up on the front of the boat. I have two Garmin graphs on the front here and with a recessed trolling motor and a padded front deck, <laughs> this office right here is a good spot to be. This 50th anniversary Ranger Z520L is not only awesome, its styling is impeccable. Check out these wheels. This trailer is handmade, built specifically for this boat. It has road armor and it is built to last. Now let's get down to what pushes this beautiful machine. You know, I've been running the Evinrude products for my entire career. And what pushes my 520L is the Evinrude E-Tech 250HO G2. I'll tell you what guys, the G2 is an amazing engine with tons of new technology. From prop to top, it's a brand new powerhead, brand new everything, redesigned. I'll tell you why I like it. Number one, torque. Pure power, guys. Fuel efficiency, and it's unbelievable on oil consumption. And the best part about it, no service for up to 300 hours. I tell you what, you can't beat that, guys. This motor right here gets the job done. I'll be honest with you, I I've kind of forgot where the service crews hang out at each one of these tournaments, but this motor right here is unbelievable, and it's an unbelievable boat. So guys, if you're looking to repower or build a brand new boat package, be sure to check out the Ranger 520L and pair it up with a brand new G2. So check out the website below for more information. Let's get back on the water. Well, I see that you've uh, you've discovered snack time. Uh huh. You deserve that after like an hour on that fish. Yeah, for real. For real. But you know what? No matter if we don't even catch another fish, just spending the day with you in the boat, yeah. out here on the road with me, traveling, it's like our own first little road trip. And hopefully, we'll teach you guys a little bit about sight fishing along the way. Dude, dude, dude! Look at that! Look at. Oh, oh, right there. Yeah. Oh yeah, that is a good one. He's just swimming down the bank, though. Where, how big do you think is he is? Dead? Uh, probably like three, four. Yes. See how I moved yeah. it and he took off? They do that, no good. I, like, I literally I literally twitched it, and the fish went. It came back in the bed, and I had the bait in the bed. Twitched it one time, the fish went poof. Took off like a rocket. Since this so one's that's, probably not Yeah, that's a new launch. Let me just see if I can. Right there, drop it. Now don't move until he comes back in the bed. OK. So what we're doing is we're just seeing if this fish will bite. I don't know if it will or not. Well, but it was actually showed God interest. is interested, yeah. Hillary put her a little touch on it. She put her a little shake, shake, shake. You know, everybody that's watching this show, it's uh, it's real important to take the young kids out fishing. Take 
your little your little son, your daughter, friend of the friend of the family, kid in the neighborhood. Take them out fishing. Get them outside. Get them in in God's creation. Like I have Hillary out here today, because it's uh, it's awesome. It's awesome to be out here. Being on the water is a beautiful thing, and uh, spending quality time with the next generation is what it's all about for sure. What you say, Hillary? Yep. Oh, I see him. He's I'm sitting. Take it a little bit. You got it. Hit him. Got him, Hillary. Hillary got him. Hillary got him. Hillary got him. <laughs> Swing him up in here, darling. Right in the boat. Yes. I want to get him. Oh, okay. Here, you get him. <laughs> you did it. It's the best part. The best part. That look. You're about not to the go. biggest one. That's not the biggest one. But here is the best part about that whole thing, Hillary. I said the fish isn't catchable. That's what I said. And you said, no, 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 hang on a minute. Let me try something. And you flipped it in there perfect. And you said, oh, oh, I think he's interested. I think, and you caught the fish. That right there was awesome. <laughs> See that? I told you, I told you I catch the fish now. If I put a little twitch, twitch, you know. <laughs> twitch, twitch, bang, bang. Hey, find me a big one, I'll catch it. You're, you're almost ready. But that was good. I actually did not think you would catch the fish, Hillary. I really didn't. I thought the fish was going to leave. It was not interested. She put her little magic touch on it. Fish spun around. Boom. It was really, really good. All right, let's keep going on this canal. See if we can find another one. That was, that was good. I was convinced could not catch the fish. <laughs> she put her little touch on it. Oh, dude, that's a big one. That's how, a big one. How big? See the tail? Look behind the, look behind the branch. And the tail's moving around. Look. Oh, I see the tail, but that, I don't see it that fully. That fish is this big. It's a giant. It's a giant. Do you think it's catchable? Yeah, I think. Oh, dad. It's oh, big. dang. It's dang, big. it is big. It's big. Oh, I see it. Yeah, see it? I think see I see yeah, almost yeah, yeah. the whole thing. Yeah, yeah. Get strike position. Easy. Just shake it easy. She's definitely looking at it. Oh, I see her. She's looking at it. Oh, I see her head. Yeah. No, I see her ball. Yeah. Come on, move it. No, 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 don't, don't, don't. She's, <gasps> she's going towards ready, it. She's going ready, towards it. Ready. She's going towards it. Strike position. She's got it. Does she have it? Lift no, up. no, no, Lift no. Up. She doesn't. Up. Dad, she doesn't. Oh Not yet. Shake it. She's shake about it. to get it. Lift up on it and shake. Oh, she might have got it. She, do you feel something? Yep. Hit her. Hit her hard. Hit her hard. Oh, you got her. Left. Oh my gosh, you got her. You got her. Keep the rod up. Rod up. Rod up. There you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. Keep the rod up. Keep the rod up. Very easy now. You got her out in the open. Go to the left. Go to the left. Uh, oh my gosh. Go this way. Go to the oh right. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It's a giant, Hillary. It's a giant. Play him easy. Play him easy. Play him easy. Play him easy. I got him. I got him. Yes. <laughs> oh my gosh. Hillary Mars, you did it. You did it, darling. You did it. Look at that bass. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Hillary Martin. Hillary. Give me some of that. Give me some of this. What else? What else can we do? Jellyfish. Oh, oh my God. Unbelievable. That is huge. Unbelievable. Oh my gosh. It's giant. That's that definitely huge. your biggest bass. You did oh awesome. Gosh. You did. She did it. She did it. She did it. <laughs> wow. Yes. You did it and everything. Ripped him right out of the grass. Got him out of there. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. gosh, this thing's huge. All right. Nine. 9-1. 9-1, Hillary oh Martin. Oh my gosh. 9-1. Unclip it. Push that right there down. Open that up. Yeah, hard, hard. Yeah, there you go. 9-1. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Hillary, come here, darling. We gotta let this fish go. I'm gonna just put him in the water for a second. Okay. 9-1. Your biggest bass ever. Right there. Okay. Oh my gosh. Here, you grab two hands. Two hands. There you go. Let's let her let's let her go real easy. Here we go. There you go. Good job, Hill. Wait, turn it that way. Oh, oh gosh. <laughs> she was in great shape. That's a big bass. <laughs> oh my goodness. That made the day. Thank you, Dad, so much for oh, taking that was me. Awesome. That was awesome. That's what a moment right there. That's something that uh almost wanna cry to be honest with you. Kind of oh man. <laughs> uh that's something that when you're old and You'll remember that. That's yeah. Cool. I'll tell you what, guys. Uh, 
Today's been a special day, being able to hang out with Hillary, enjoy the day on the water with her. We caught several nice fish today. Yeah. Didn't catch a lot, but we learned a lot. We spent time together. A lot of fun. Hopefully you learned a few things about sight fishing. Yeah. You know, saw how we did it, kind of mm -hmm. what we did on that. So stay tuned next week. New show, new challenge. Thanks for watching the Scott Morning Challenge, guys. We'll see you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. <laughs> that was awesome. Yeah. Good stuff. Ha, ha, ha.